let's talk about how we can use that experience that we have as genetic service consumers to um, make the world a better place for ourselves and also for other families who are coming up through the system or who are just going to be introduced to the system as they, as they get older. One can say, you know, we've all been dealt a lemon having a genetic disorder, and I, um, but what we do with it um, and how we use that um, to help the system of genetic services can be really beneficial to us, can be beneficial to families, and it definitely can be beneficial to NIMAC, hearing from all the stakeholders, because we are a stakeholder. Uh, we have a voice and a story to tell about genetics experience, even if it does not include a solid diagnosis. That's in bold there because honestly, my kids don't have a solid diagnosis. We know it's a connective tissue disorder, but we don't know the genetic code for it. We don't know what proteins are affected. We don't know any of that stuff. We just know they have markers for a connective tissue disorder, particularly with the aortic aneurysm and the other aortic issues that the kid, uh, boys have. So, but I still, I, you know, I talk to parents all the time, genetic odyssey, you, you, you suspect your child has a genetic condition, doesn't have a solid, solid diagnosis. That is a really important story to tell because we have valuable insight in how the system really works for families and how service delivery can be improved to get more patients to genetics for a possible explanation and diagnosis. Uh, we have an opportunity to share our story and be part of system change within the or within the system of genetics so it's really important that we kind of share that we sh um share our stories you'll see the, the top it says nothing about us without us actually bruce introduced me to that phrase many many years ago at an imac meeting and i i put it on many of my slides because in order to um have an effective system change you have to um, evaluate it from all levels of the system and all stakeholders need to take part so thank you bruce <laughs> 